Looks like snapping turtles have been laying eggs in here. Uh huh. You can see it. They've all been dug up by predators. Oh, so you think they dug it up? Yeah. You know what could have dug these? King what? snake. Really? And that would explain why there's no eggshells. What do you got there? Got a pine wood. Pine wood snake. Is that a six line race runner here? It looks like a gravid female, most likely. See how fat she is. Right here we have a, uh, a six-line race runner hole, and we saw a male or a female just run out from it, and uh, you can see where they've dug out and all the dirt and stuff, and it's actually really flat, like they have to squeeze in there. And they actually lay their eggs under there, according to Wayne, so they're pretty cool. We're going to leave it there. Alright guys, well what we got here is uh, two six-line race runners, or I uh, can't really remember the scientific name. but really beautiful looking lizards you see uh, this is a male and you can see he's got the really nice blue belly and here's a female and she's got a white belly and uh, you can see the male kind of broke his tail off while we were catching him but these guys are extremely fast and we'll demonstrate that in a little bit but you can see where they got the six line name because they got the six lines on the back really beautiful species you can see the meme, or female is really, really fat. She might have eggs or she's just fat. And you can see they're pretty tired because they run like crazy. And uh, interestingly, they look just like little tagues if you look at them. Just amazing. They got huge belly scales. Like, like usually the ones I find have little grains for, or granules for belly scales. But they got the feel of like a you know like a iguana or something really neat you can see yeah this is the female you see the male he's got the breeding blue colors on the side the female's got the white he's even got blue on the side of his face but uh... me and wayne were uh, catching him over on the hills and stuff and so we were chasing him around like crazy almost look like maniacs but yeah, an interesting fact about these guys is that they're uh, asexual sometimes. The females can actually reproduce without a male. So that's pretty interesting. I'm not sure. I think, are they the only species that can that do that? Uh, I think there's other species. Huh. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, what Wayne's got here is, oh, he's got a little juvenile here to show you. Hold on. See, here's a little juvenile. He's a little guy. And you can see, sometimes they're called whip tails because they have a really long tail. As you can see. And they're all pretty tired. Three six-line race runners. So we're probably going to let them go here right now. Wayne here's got uh, two uh, northern black racers. He flipped under one tire rim, so it's pretty cool. You can see, one took a pretty big bad bite out of my finger. You want to bring them up? They're crazy. And they're actually male and female pair. It's pretty cool. Dude, this one's like psycho. See, it's 
see that? Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> a male and female pair, they're both in shed too, so it's pretty cool. Oh, strike mine. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you ain't getting me. They make a sick photo. I don't think they're gonna take off. They ain't, they're fighting. Oh. Alright guys, we got our uh, second Eastern King Snake of the Year. And a really pretty one at, at that too. It's a male, turns out. He thought he was grabbing at first. See, he's just perfect condition, nice. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome, dude, look at him. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. See that beautiful, nice, clean pattern? Really clean. Every band. Went down to the tail. Oh, dude, this is awesome. I wonder if he ate the other thing. <laughs> <laughs> 